Right, welcome to the RAM upgrade of the MSI. Now I wanted to make a 16 gig because I was playing FIFA 21. And I noticed, based on my camera angle that I like to use, there's a bit of stuttering. Maybe it'll fix it, maybe it won't. Anyway, I bought this, which there'll be a link in the description. Now the reason why I went on this one is because I was looking how to upgrade RAM, of course. And I found it in Hot UK Deals where two people recommended it. So, yeah, that's what I've done. Hopefully. Because there was no comeback to say it didn't work, so it should work. I don't know what I'm doing, but let's go and see if I can do it. All I do know is, right, to open this up, you got to unscrew that screw there and that screw there. When you first get this machine... This would like have a little sticker on it, and you'd be like, Whoa, how do I open it? And then, you, of course, you, you realize oh, crap, that it does have a sticker on it, and it's like really, um, you know, you know, with fingers, you've done it, All right? So, I'll be back in a smoke, I mean, in a vape, when I get it off. So, when you get it off, you just do uh, it really. Easy. And welcome back. I'm assuming, right, I'm assuming that this. There's a RAM thing over here. I'm not sure if it is, but it is screwed in, like. Um, I'm pretty sure that's the RAM thing there where you put your RAM in. Um, so have a look at the other side. I don't see. Uh, there's one thing down there. That could be a RAM. So yeah, I haven't got a clue. I just ain't got a clue because everything's got numbers on and stuff. But doesn't it look all there? Um, I always thought a PC or something would all be crammed together, but it turns out it's not crammed together. Alright, and when you take that off, make sure you take it, lift it up like. So let me see if it's alright to put on here. So, here we go. Oh crap, I don't want to touch anything you see. Um, right, so what we do, we get this ram out of here. And I still don't know which way it does. Does it go backwards? Does it go forwards? You know? Does it turn it around that way? I don't know. You know what I mean? It, nobody really says. And plus, right, all the um, video reviews I've seen, um, they've all been like these big long things. And this is like a really, um, it's like a thing. I'm going to assume to do it that way. No, that way won't work. I assume to do it this way. Ooh! Is this? There's a click, you get that there, and you do it there, because it was already fitting this way. Right, I think I've got to open things up. It's not clicking into place. I don't I don't wanna don't want it. I'll be back in a minute. So I'm having technical difficulties. It won't actually go in. It's just going to the side. Um, I'm just, I'm really scared of pushing it down because I don't want to break it, you know what I mean? It seems so flimsy. But we'll try and get there so in the far, I might, I might have been putting it in the wrong way. But it looks like it goes in this way. But I don't know how to move those little metal things. Um, I'm trying my best. I mean, it looks like it clicks in right there. And it looks like it clicks in there. But we're getting there, we're getting there. And there we go. I didn't have any ceramic. Uh, I've lost my ceramic uh, tweezers, but I used something like this to push that out a bit, and now it locks into place. Um, I'm hoping that's how you do it. Everything seems like it's clicked in. Uh, I mean, doing it the other way around, you know, the case wouldn't have gone on. So hopefully that's um, fingered. And plus, if you turn it the other way around, um, it will go in. So hopefully, we've done the right things. It's all clicked in. It didn't even say any of this on YouTube when I was looking at the videos. So let's hope for the best, and I'll turn it on. Right, and the good news is, it worked. It came up on the screen when I was turning it on. That, um... You have to press F1 and that. But I didn't actually read it properly. And it wasn't until it went off that it came back on. But as you can see, on my finger goes, 
I am now on 16 gigabyte of RAM and it also says, in case you're wondering if you bought it off Veri or somewhere like that but it did say i5-10400 and then it said in the technical specifications 10400F at least you know for definite it's a 10400F um, sitting like there, 16 gig um, and I think that's it, I, I, I think we've done it yeah, and hopefully my FIFA will play better in a certain camera angle yeah, so, and, and right, this is a good thing and I have actually done something that hasn't bolstered up because you know I went to change the brakes on my bike, bowled that up. Um, I'm always doing stuff that bowls up. Um, the only two things I've ever done in my life has gone off straight away and totally done it is painting my front room and the bathroom. Totally easy that. And um, putting this ram in. So yeah, I will tell you what ram you need. I'm not sure if this is. Okay, does that say uh, yeah? I bought this for twenty nine quid off um, Amazon. I'm not sure if you can get it cheaper anywhere else, but what threw me was the size of it. So even even on the laptop ones, what I was looking on YouTube, it was this long. So you know what I mean. So yeah, well that, that's it. That's me, the M twenty one. I hope this uh, helps you figures it out. As you know, I was putting it in wrong, but you know that's just the way the cookie crumbles.